the wrong button. Oh no, I'm having issues. Hold on. Roller disconnected. I'm having OBS issues. More locked doors. Who the hell keeps locking everything? Whoever he is. I bet he's got a goddamn combination lock on the John at home. These doors My God, will be open shut via up. a symbolic gesture during the ceremony. Symbolic how? The system of mirrors will focus beams of light on the model of our solar system hanging above the entrance. I'll see what I can do. On controller? I don't know. I don't play with controller. I think that was just my Xbox controller. I was playing Yakuza 0 directly, like, before this. Uh, so that's why I had a controller plugged in. This is keyboard and mouse currently. Oh, I probably have to move this maybe back. Uh, the mirror on the left isn't working. Something is jamming the mechanism and preventing the mirror from ascending. Got it. Looks like it's back to the basement for me. No I bet it's entry. robots. And a skull and crossbones. That's encouraging. Where am I? The magnetic shock absorption system is located on this. Did they add? Yeah, because it's an excellent game. I really like it. I just don't like playing it. I don't like the combat in it at all. But the story stuff is so good. Oh my god, it is so freaking good. Uh, they did not add it. Okay, hold on. White screen. All updates. Cart. Should fix my problems in a second here. Basement level. All the rooms here are full of mobile electromagnetic clusters. I can use an EMP on them. There we go. It's not going to kill me, is it? Let's hope not. Comrade Major. What? So I could get crushed by a falling wall of magnets? Theoretically speaking, that shouldn't happen, but this is merely a hypothesis. I've never been here before. Seriously? That's weird. Well, whatever. I don't understand what I <clears throat> wants me to do. <laughs> like it wants me to pull down that whole wall? Go ahead and save. There's got to be something I can. Might I remind you that you can change the magnet's polarity with a single shock charge? I forgot. <laughs> that was helpful. I definitely forgot that. <laughs> You know what I kind of hate is how he treats his glove, even though I'm pretty sure the glove is, like, the bad guy in this game. Comrade Major, have you made but it to the he treats the glove like China. shit for What's the glove only ever mean? answering his problems there. or answering his questions. I'm in the magnetic shock absorption chamber, looking for a way to unlock the entrance doors. Can you open them for me? No, I can't. I don't have the skills. <gasps> this is your responsibility. Then get off my grill. Okay, that dude deserved being talked down to. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. I wasn't paying attention. What you staring at? What you staring at, you metal dipshit? That's the wrong button. Alright, man. Thanks for the right. I appreciate it. Have a good one.
Holy crap. Are all those frame drops from when I was loading and working on uh, getting Yuzu running? You guys haven't been getting frame drops Another since I started this lock. game, have you? Uh, where's the relay, Charles? Yikes, that's a big number. On the walls. Not that you've noticed, okay. Thank you, thank you. I'm actually looking forward to going back to Metroid Prime. I played Metroid Prime back in the day, uh, and I didn't like it because I don't like using a controller for any first person game, basically, ever. So playing the remaster with keyboard and mouse, I am excited to give it a shot again to see how I feel. The problem I'm having is I don't know how to get through this door. Can I just pull it open? the hell is the button to see things again what's the point of this fucking maze anyway the magnetic shock absorption system was developed by scientists from Kiev Polytechnic University it's a very complex and comprehensive device that alters its configuration according to the situation so it's plan B in case of a natural disaster among other things but it is first and foremost a trial run of the magnetic shock absorption system here, under Earth conditions, the system will be perfected so that it can be deployed in space. Cool. Science is power. There's no denying it. But we still need to find a way past all these goddamn magnets. How do they work? Freaking magnets. I'm a little bit worried about what's going to happen when I do this. Probably at least one more down here somewhere. Alright, I think I'm going to have to flip them around while I'm up on them. I actually don't know how to get back up now. The thing I find int whoa, the thing I find interesting about this game is that if it wasn't for the main protagonist, I would think it's probably like a solid 7. <laughs> the protagonist and kind of how much of a piece of garbage he is single-handedly takes this whole experience down almost like a full point of enjoyment for me. <laughs> I don't remember the last time a game has done that. Oh, 
Oh, there's a bunch more things over there. High on life doesn't count. The thing is, is that high on life, it's not really what they were saying or the fact, like, the things the guns were saying, weren't saying, were saying, rather, wasn't the problem for me. It was that they wouldn't stop. Ever. That was my problem with that game. If I had kept playing more of it, there probably would have been a point where they would have stopped though. at some point, I would think. But I don't know, maybe there wouldn't be. And it would have just annoyed me the whole time. It's also a possibility. Confused as to what I'm even... Okay, I see. It's over there. Okay. I see where it is. Thought I could maybe make it. to get in there. And that one doesn't move, really. Charles, what the hell does Molotov have against Dr. Sechenov? Why do you have to cook this commission up two days before the launch of Collective? Everything's ready. Exactly because everything is ready. What do you mean? Are you trying to say that Molotov and his commission want to steal the fruits of Sechenov's labor two days before the launch? Indeed. The malfunction Petrov caused is an excellent pretext for showing that Dr. Sechenov is incapable of overseeing Facility 3826, and by extension, the polymerization of the Soviet Union. What's the boss got to do with it? This is all Petrov's fault. He's the one who made the robots turn the facility into a heap of corpses. I'm afraid Comrade Molotov doesn't care how many victims there are, but neither does Comrade Sechenov. What? What the fuck are you talking about, Glove? The boss is doing everything he can to fix this. To be precise, Comrade Major, it's you doing everything you can to fix this, not Dr. Sechenov. But he's the one who sent me here. But why did he do that? Think about it logically. Comrades Sechenov and Molotov both have something to gain from preventing information about this terrible malfunction becoming known to the rest of the world. Because no one would believe that a handful of traitors are responsible for the whole thing. Everybody would think that Soviet robots are dangerous. Quite right. But what conclusion should we draw from this? Only that, hypothetically, comrades Sechenov and Molotov should both have a vested interest in ending this nightmare as quickly as possible. Isn't that right? Yeah. So what? We're seeing a common, everyday power struggle. Instead of going to the government and having troops sent to Facility 3826 to destroy the hostile robots, arrest Petrov, or end this in some other way, Dr. Sechenov is doing everything he can to conceal the tragedy from everyone, including the government. Okay, so that's still safe. Need to get over there. Do it from there. You need to get over there. This way. They can't send in the army. There are too many people. Somebody could leak intel to the enemy and then it's all over. But only reliable men could be sent to the facility, such as the Argentum unit loyal to Sechenov. 
They could team up with combat robots and restore order in the blink of an eye. But I don't need to tell you about that, do I? But that's, I mean, ugh, crispy critters. I don't get it. Why does it have to be so complicated? Because Dr. Sechenov can't deploy troops or combat robots without the authorization of the Politburo. On the contrary, he's doing everything he can to make sure the government doesn't know what happened. Why do you think that is? Because his enemies would take collective away from him? Now, when everything's built and ready to go, and any asshole with a badge could run it. Quite right. It's all done. Just fix the malfunction and press a button. Geniuses, creators, and engineers have already done their jobs. All that's left to do is enjoy the fruits of their labor. In other words, Comrade Molotov wants to put Dr. Sechenov in jail over what happened here so he can take over the facility himself? To be exact, he wants to lead Collective. But how can he? Everybody's going to be equal there. Some will be more equal than others. No, I know that high-ranking Communist Party members will have more authority in Collective than ordinary citizens, but that's fine. I mean, somebody's got to make big decisions, right? Is that so? Why, pray tell? Well, first off, somebody has to be responsible for carrying them out. It's not like everyone can be responsible for everything. Everyone means no one. Someone's got to take responsibility. The buck has to stop somewhere, right? And if the whole world did nothing but debate big decisions, no one would ever do anything. They'd spend all their time talking. But what if you're wrong? You say that the entire world would never stop discussing important decisions. Collective is a collective mind. Having merged into one, mankind will instantly know everything anyone wants to express. And in this singular collective, responsibility will be determined not by fear of punishment, but by awareness. Has anyone ever reached that level, even here in the USSR? We're not perfect, to say nothing of the rest of the world. Absolutely right. The world may not be ready for the launch of collective. The Soviet Union's leaders understand this. That's why the party will have special discretionary authority within Collective. What's wrong with that? That's how it's always been. Has it really? Or has there always been one indisputable leader? A puppet master controlling the Politburo, the Council of Ministers, and all the rest. Are you trying to say there's going to be one single leader in Collective? I'm trying So this little thing is the reason everything's all jammed up? <sighs> this place is nuts. You can ascend to the surface along with the mirror. For once? You're right. I'd probably reach Nirvana before I could make it back down the way I came. Oh, I did it. Okay. Playing super hot. I love that game. I was gonna say movie. Crispy critters. Uh, we do not know passcode for that yet. Major. God, this song is so good. I'm gonna let you guys enjoy this music while I go grab water. I'll be right back.
clean up cat puke as well. <laughs> that song is so good. I need to get into the exhibit. How do I open the door? The time can be opened with my multi key error. Multi key not found. All Terish Cobra models can transform their index fingers into keys. It's one of their basic functions. Looks like you lost your multi key. My forearms have been torn off by miscreants. Error. The required manipulative node is missing. The unlocking function cannot be initiated. Right. Where could she have lost her hands? I suggest you start searching this location. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Charles, what do the special neuro connectors for Collective look like? You know, the ones the government is supposed to get. The ones they will get look like thought devices, but in a golden diamond encrusted shell. Mm -hmm. The scientists from Dr. Sechenov's team have already received different devices. Different? You mean there's going to be ones with different capabilities? According to Dr. Sechenov's plan, the bureaucrats and civil servants will receive fakes. Only the scientists will receive real connectors with discretionary authority. The boss is going to try to deceive the government? That's crazy. How do you know that? Where did you get your neuropolymer glove from, comrade major? What? You mean yourself? I got you from Dr. Sechenov. Exactly. Hold on. You mean he gave me his own glove? The fate of his life's work depends on the success of your mission. <laughs> he did ask me to be careful with you. Please, please pr proceed to the information room. It's a phase. It'll pass. It's already passing. I can't even remember my own name anymore. But his metal mug is still there. I still remember the bastard gutting me. They told us robots were going to replace us. That staff, and, well, they certainly did. There's nothing I can do for you. All right. I'll fix it. I guess I gotta do everything around here. Looking at this worthless hunk of junk. What? The backstabbing machine. Huh. It's not a big beef. They told us for that's what I was. Wow. That didn't do anything. Alright. Well, I'm glad I haven't done anything to help these dumbasses. Unless he gives me something now. Oh, what now? An eternity looking at. There's nothing I can do for you. That's <gasps> ridiculous. for shotgun shells in here. Department of Corrections report number 4400. Oleg Lazarev, the employee who disappeared, has been found. The theory that he was on a bender turned out to be false. 
The engineer's body was found in the magnetic earthquake system in a state that prevented it from being identified without DNA analysis. Squad 5 performed a series of procedures to delete data in facility 3826's archive, and any references to Conrad Lazarus have been removed from Damas OS social networks. We have been ordered to hold a training seminar for the VDNH's junior earthquake system staff about the serious danger the magnets pose to all employees. This is the third one this year. People need to take this seriously. Dead bodies all over the place. Take me in a circle? What the hell? Oh, I need to go this way. Okay. It does feel that way. And there's Tereshkova's arm. What's that metal pervert doing with it? That is a robot waiter. Who's serving the people it killed? I'm gonna smash that fucking bot to bits. The robot isn't currently hostile. We should be able to retrieve the arm without a fight. I will say the looting mechanic never gets old to me. It's still pretty satisfying to... It's the animations of just like you flaming everything open. And vacuuming up stuff that's like good. I know it's only animations, but it feels good. put stuff you can't really easily get to back there. Fuck that. There's no way I'm leaving that thing alive. was honestly surprised by that <laughs> not surprising in the least how does it work hold it up to my neurosensor contacts <laughs> multi-key activated Okay. Now what? Thank you for coming to my aid. Not having the key felt like I was missing a limb. One moment, please. Did we fix her or break her? The Tereshkova is a state-of-the-art model with a self-repairing system. A famous actress and cosmonaut contributed to its creation. I don't give two wet farts. My Pipe down. Please select the desired procedure. What an asshole.
Okay, what are we doing? Guess I have to Greetings, talk to comrades, and what the fuck? No, what the fuck? Crispy critters. Now I gotta deal with another crazy ass lock. Fuck, I'm a magnet for annoying bullshit. Tell me about it. This guy thinks he's annoyed. He's never had to play Atomic Heart. This guy would hate himself. I mean, the the secret is we all hate traits about ourselves. So when we see those traits mirrored back to us, we actually do. <laughs> so yes, I very much think he would hate himself. Voice of the motherland. About this Darwin test. Yes, I am always happy to help, Major. Just watch your fingers. I'd rather not have to look for that multi key again. The hammer, tool of working men. The sickle, peasant's friend. The many pointed star they praise and with their lives defend. Put something cheerful on, would you? It kind of feels like the end of the world right now. Radio of the future! Astonishing music generated by the state-of-the-art quantum supercomputer based on the preferences and tendencies of the modern performers. The theory of relativity claims these are the songs that the citizens of the future will be listening to. But the citizens of today are already listening to it. Doesn't that mean this is going to be the music of the past once we actually get there? And nobody's going to write it 30 years from now because it already exists. The music of the future could change every second. Well spotted. You have discovered a temporal paradox. How very observant you are. The music of the future shapes the music style in the present. However, the superposition of the observer and the information being perceived are located within a self-consistent loop. In layman's terms, we are always listening to the music of the future and determining what it is going to be like at the same time. Oh, shit. If that's layman's terms, I'd hate to hear the complicated explanation. I'm getting a fucking headache here. Here you go. This is as alive as it gets around here. Hear the spring's cheerful hymn. Be yourself, strive and earn. Life, I love you and hope you love me in return. Oh, shut your face, you dumbass toaster! I'm sorry. All this chaos is causing my emotional algorithms to malfunction. Pioneer Nichayev, you passed the Darwin test with flying colors. Tell me, what do you want to be when you grow up? A cosmonaut. What a splendid career choice. I would... Well, I'd rather enjoy your attention, Major. Now, how can I help you? Do you have a memory leak or something? I need to announce a drill and put the VDNH into drill mode. Unfortunately, this is beyond my ability. Are you yanking my fucking chain? But I can provide you with a solution. You see, a single robot cannot engage the military Fuck. This whole thing is just monstrous. The robots must have completely lost their minds.
You know what made Bioshock an instant classic and amazing game? It was the fact that you were stuck in this place where nothing was described to you and you didn't have people shoving a bunch of weird shit down your throat you about the world Helping every two fucking seconds. Responders is such a noble goal, but you... you just knew that there was some bad stuff going on and you were trying to get out. <laughs> the whole premise. Guy takes an elevator in a lighthouse after a plane crash and uh, finds himself in a nightmare. And this one, it just stands there buck naked as if nothing god. were wrong. Oh my Nothing's god, good. fucking kill me, dude. Publicly exposing your you do realize he didn't do it himself, right? He's gonna oh stop at everything, That's isn't she? That's a mess. And who, I wonder, will have to clean it up? I should dispatch the cleaners this instant. No, wait. It's the cleaners that did it. I'm so scatterbrained today. Oh my god. This might be the worst escort mission I've ever seen. Oh, I envy you humans. You can just pick up a razor and shave that horrible monstrous mustache off. But this one, you're not even a machine, you nitwit. You're just an imitation, a caricature, a piece of lab equipment. Pardon the outburst. It's just that one of them used to try to... Oh, well, let's change the subject. Ever brought up the There's a wide range of the lab tech models. The ones in black turned out to be especially vicious. They've been using their harmless built-in range-finding laser to pick off humans from a distance. How did it ever come to this? Just so you know, the black lab tech specialization is determined by the software package encoded within a specially constructed Kinetico Scholar Neurogel capsule. You can salvage this package from one of the defeated black lab techs, provided its capsule is still in one piece. What? I didn't understand a single thing you just said. You're an assistant, Tereshkova. Talk human. Shocking! You have no sense of decency. I gather you've already met Nora, the monstrous repair vendor who's subjecting humans to unimaginable deadly hey, Buddha. torture. Welcome, it pays my Raiders. algorithms to have to send you into her bloody I'm debating budget. my life choices in no playing choice. this game right now. She's the only mechanism capable of utilizing this capsule to upgrade Hope you guys weapon. like to hear bullshit. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Move your ass, Tereshkova. Right. We're in a hurry. I'm driving! On my Give me way, a comrade! Eleven! Wait, you already have that one. Let me reroll it. Okay. You, you love have... bullshit? <laughs> oh, no, you don't. That's the Abraham can free separate stages. That's the one you're doing. I am so angry. <laughs> I Is that Sonic Racing? That. <laughs> if that had happened a second later, then oh, I would have been able to re good boy. Oh my Who's god. Shot the Fuck off. You little oh. goo. Hey, you can attack you people <laughs> even when you're in combat. <laughs> I'm gonna give more attention to your clip because this robot's making me hate okay. everything. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. Now back to hell. That mode, because you're such a little sweetie, isn't that right? Aren't you precious? We have to wait for this dumbass to. Here we are, comrade. Yeah, the administrative get here. control drive should be at this booth. Please establish the connection. God, please. What am I doing? Oh. Why did we get so tall all of a sudden? Only try to be gentle, comrade oh, Major. She went on her knees. I have very delicate internals. Oh, 
What just snapped? Relax, bot. That's my joints cracking. Does this look all right? Administrator level rights granted successfully. What now? I'm opening the door to the atrium for you. Search each of the complex's floor and find my dear Claire. I'll be in touch over the radio. As soon as you reach a floor, I'll scan it for my poor friend's parts. Most of her is on the ground floor. Please put her back together again. Holy crap, we're free. We're actually wow, free. Oh my god. Out. It's like a palace. Talk about class. Let me just drink it all in. Attention, BDNH staff. Can't open that yet. Uh, frig off. We should have timed that escort. No. <laughs> we should just never ever do that again. I'm afraid there's nothing I can do for you now. If you're concerned about me being deceased, you don't have to worry. It is indeed too late for that now. Then what's the matter? You, see you know what? I don't care. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't care. That's new. Holy shit. Surely there's more bots somewhere. Oh my god. Fucking piece of garbage scared the shit out of me. <laughs> oh. I'm dead. That didn't kill me. This one.
another one of these doors here. felt very hotline Miami. Fading data. So, what will it be, Major? The upgrades so, are getting what expensive. Will it be, Major? one that we need. There's probably one on the other floors that I missed or skipped. Now I'm gonna... I'm gonna double check the other floors. Tried opening that door on the other end. Nothing worked though. the exhibition area module head found establishing coordinates assessing structural integrity shit it's dark here
Well, that gave me a lot of stuff to pick up at least, I guess. Crispy fucking. Where's the shit ass way out of here? Underground or something? I love in media properties when somebody says exactly what they need to do, but angrily. Oh, what? Am I like supposed to go underground and get to the other room so I can unlock it and come back, maybe? He changed his catchphrase. No, he's just angry. His catchphrase is still crispy critters. Fuck me. Where am I supposed to find the head? You need to enter Icarus Hall. It is located on the second story of this venue. So where's the entrance? Unfortunately, I do not have this information. Everything got mixed up after the malfunction. No shit, Sherlock. Have you considered powering from the gun? How is that supposed to help? I don't know. It's just a suggestion. Well, I guess it can't hurt to try. It's not like we've got a lot of other options. Tereshkova, oh, where's the no. power room around here? At the very top! Fantastic. Cut off. Just what I always wanted. Oh. That's bad. There's security cameras there. I see. I don't understand how to kill that robot. Probably. Okay, maybe for the battle or something? Charles, what do the special neuro connectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuro connectors have the Greek letter Gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter beta on them. But the beta connectors were real at first. Uh, I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority were called beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. That's so, until the Sigma after the connectors came. experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuro connectors. 
enhanced gamma models shaped like bracelets were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? For Vavilov, Korolyov, Kurchatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filomonenko, and Chelome? Indeed. Where's oh the very top? Oh my god, my frame rate just died. I'm stuck? There we go. Why would they put them there? There's no spot that I can like shoot them at, is there?
this because if I don't there we go I was gonna say if I don't kill this thing they're just gonna knock me off each time oh, we got it thank god Shocking, at least. <laughs> What's up, Vaz? This is where the power comes from. Are you sure? I'm dumb, endlessly stupid. I died because of my stupidity. If somebody buries me, put these words on my tombstone. I wouldn't hold your breath. They'll probably just dump you all in a mass grave. Me too, Why? man. Me too. Did many other people die? Yeah. Way too many. Ooh, that's nice. I wouldn't want to, you know, stray from the collective. <laughs> the more the merrier, right? Yeah. Good times. Okay. They all need to be green. Oh, this is a, like, outside, outside. Are you able to read the, uh, are you Russian or at least able to read it, I guess? I suppose you don't need to be Russian to be able to read it. Do you speak as well or just read? Wait, how the fuck did he get in here? What?
another one in here that was still alive? Granted. Unnamed shooting. That stuff would be pretty good. Start buying into that a little bit more. What's up? How did your Resident Evil 4 stream go? Thank you for the reason. bunch of annoying enemy placements in that game. I think I need to go back up to the second floor. Definitely missed something there.
Yeah, that's fair. It's funny because the castle is definitely like one of the better locations in the game, but I think some of the enemy fights and stuff you have to do in it are some of the worst. There's something over there I should be able to go for. I didn't really check what's down here either. Oh. Red 9 is so good. It's like, it's my favorite gun. By far. I don't know what that button does. Honestly, the red nine is like what I be I basically when I get that I'll use that to the for the rest of the game. I'll just keep upgrading it. That's usually my go-to gun. I don't actually know how to get up there. the same spot, right? Yeah. New scanning cycle. Module, limb, leg, left, not found. <sighs> Just great. So where am I even supposed to look? I swear on my cooling unit. These mustached perverts must have dragged her into this the- This place used to be really nice. Until everybody got killed. It is a most tragic sight. Oh, 
whoops. They've been going. This is Atomic Heart. Hey, this is new. You may need to apply spatial reasoning here. There's no may about it. These locks of yours are really something, you know that? Spatial reasoning, huh? Charlie, why couldn't they just put regular, more reliable locks everywhere? Like with codes and shit? I suspect it's because if they had, anyone who had the code would be able to open the locks without authorization. Yeah, but now anyone who solves the puzzles can get through. In other words, pretty much anybody. Charles, I've never seen Dr. Sechenov wearing a bracelet before. Does his Alpha Connector look different? Indeed it does. His device is unique, and its shape and location are one of Dr. Sechenov's deepest secrets. So his Alpha Connector must be really well guarded. Who's watching, Argentum? Entrusting humans with the Connector would be far too risky. It's guarded by Dr. Sechenov's personal bodyguards. You mean the Ballerina Twins? The way they move, they're so graceful and elegant. They kind of remind me of something. Is that so? What exactly, Comrade Major? I don't know. Something... something good. What? <laughs> something good.
Why is the shocking not doing it? Or am I shocking the wrong thing? Honestly, I'm a little too tired to actually want to do a puzzle. I was kind of hoping it would be more shooty shooty. I've been falling, trying to not to fall asleep for the last hour. <clears throat> so a puzzle is not exactly what I was hoping for. the whole thing well the main reason I switched to this game was because I was playing Yakuza 0 4 and that's essentially just watching a giant movie and I felt like I needed to like do some gameplay because I was falling asleep. Maybe that one looks like I can perhaps jump up to the top area. Oh my god. Yeah, there's the wake up crew, exactly. Scared the ever loving Christ out of me, dude. I was not expecting them to be on the corner like that. Holy shit. Oh, 
there was a doorway there, I just noticed. Maybe that's the idea. Ah. Huh. Truth is out there. I've never seen bots like these before. This robot is very dangerous in melee combat. Uh, oh, so that's why I'm getting my ass kicked. What? I'm not fighting it though. Yet. Where's your fucking button? Oh my god. We found a leg. Charles, why did the boss take the real beta connectors out of commission? Were they defective? Not entirely. Dr. Sechenov wasn't convinced that there was any need for discretionary authority within Collective. So the boss wanted total equality, but Molotov's schemes changed his mind. Perhaps so, Comrade Major. What do you mean, perhaps? Dr. Sechenov wanted Boy. equality for everyone. There can be no question of that. But consider this. Here's yeah. your leg. Do yourself a pair thing. <laughs> cool tech. Still gotta find a way to get to the second floor. I actually don't know if it is either. Hold on. I think it is. I think it's allowed. Oh, neat. Where are you from anyway, Vaz? Let's see if this thing helps. So this obviously does something. Why did that work the last time I tried it? Okay, now we can get to the second one. Oh, yeah. Or it oh, you are from Russia? Right. Nice. I have, what do we uh, have here? a buddy who Tereshkova, lived in Russia. Do you copy? I mean, Dear 
until the like all this stuff is happened. You know? So, where's that head of yours? My so, head he is and his wife moved. For Major now, Nichayev, code name Pete. Till things cool down a bit. Yeah. The shame. They had like just bought a house. <laughs> well, not a house, an apartment or whatever. They still have it. It's just they. Yeah, they're hoping they can go back to it. I don't think they know what they're gonna do with it now. <laughs> Looks like a maze for kids. This will be a cakewalk. Where am I trying to put the ball though? Probably the other side. Jumpy little thing, ain't ya? Oh, I see the path, okay. I would sell all you can. Yeah. If you don't mind my asking, what part uh, were you, of Russia were you from? He was from, I think he was How in uh, you, huh? Petersburg. I think Petersburg. Hey, I think I get it. I still don't really know where the exit for this is. Oh, there, I see it now. Now we're getting somewhere. Also, St. Petersburg. Such a shame, man. Do you have any idea what you're doing, Major? What do you mean? I'm almost done. Like, what the hell does this game want from me? Oh, just a sec. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Gotcha! Let us nice! Go. Easy. I am one when warmth and beauty mingle. At the past turn. Oh, good first person. On this future sense, the sun blazing gold, cooking it to a turn with eager care. So to repay to nature hundredfold what she had mingled there. The sky, Where's as her on head? the opening of a flower, on the superb obscenity smile bright. The stench <laughs> drove at us with such fearsome power. You thought we'd swoon outright. Flies trump. Oh, is it underneath? Enough is enough. When Florida poured in it is. Barring... Okay. Yes, found the head. We gotta keep moving. Charles, any idea how much time we got left? I cannot say for sure. But definitely not much. Gotcha. They arrested two under kids in the wall. No good, man. No good. of a city called Chalamet, named in Charles, all of its so after the whole beta connector idea was dead, they made the neuro connectors with discretionary authority? I'm afraid so. 
The power struggle in the Kremlin will never end. The party elite insisted on having power even within collective. Well, they're our government, right? We're the USSR. Indeed, we are. But Collective was designed to be for everyone on Earth, and the USSR is not the only country. We oh, am I dumb? I'm dumb. Imperialist and Collective. Why not? I just made the wrong Collective ammo. Collective was designed as a worldwide union for equal human beings, where robots will do everything for them. Everyone will have the same opportunities. The capitalists won't like the sound of that. Unfortunately, no one in power will see equality as an appealing prospect. So to avoid being crushed by the Kremlin, Dr. Sechenov programmed discretionary authority into Collective. I see. This is a stupid amount of shotgun shells I'm making. That de them, funny enough. How do you like that, gearhead? Lights out. more of them. These ones scare me because that range is actually pretty good. Fuck it, tin man. playing every shooter like doom i also thought she would say something to be honest with you it's a little weird that she didn't because everything else in this game just doesn't Base shut up cycle. module limb arm right found location vavilov floor transmission obstructed data incomplete <sighs> What's the holdup? Why can't we locate the module this time? I'm afraid I can't help you. There's some kind of interference on this floor. Possible sources of interference include electromagnetic shielding or the presence of a large, elongated object. A large, elongated object? That sounds odd.
Pretty sure they have some remark, yeah. Wow. There's a big honking thing in here. And lots of lip fuckers. Kind of me weird music, huh? <laughs> what am I supposed to do with this? Oh, it's Snake. What is this, a kid's game? That is a puzzle key. Nice. What's it for? I believe it activates some sort of process. Holy fuck, Charles! Is that the process I just activated? Run! Where? Hey, hey! What the hell are you doing, damn it? <laughs> okay. You metal son of a bitch. All right, man. You scared whatever. the ever living fuck out of me. That was close. Well, whatever. I got the arm. This looks like the right one. Let's go find the rest. Is there a camera? What do you mean? Oh, like why am I getting attacked so much? No, I don't think so. That was a weirdly large amount of dudes though. I guess because this wing or whatever didn't have like a giant puzzle to solve, they just decided, what if we just like throw a bunch of NPCs at them? I'm thinking is why. Over dudes to exactly. So, what was wrong with the real beta connectors? Since Collective was originally planned without any discretionary authority, everyone in it was supposed to be equal. Yeah, we already talked about that. 
Then why'd they need the beta connectors? To secure oh, collective they come. against unforeseen threats from individuals who might wish to control it. That's impossible. Everybody's equal in collective. Wait, that went through Shit. the wall? The alpha connector. Indeed. Intruders or an opposition force among equals who try to obtain the alpha connector. This could lead to human casualties, which would be unacceptable. So how could beta connectors stop? Oh my god, I'm stuck. I can't move. Oh my god, I'm getting beat down. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely beat down. You scared the ever living fuck out of me. That was you know close. Well, whatever. I oh, I can't arm. leave. You have to fight this them. Looks like the right one. Let's the door's the locked. Since Collective was originally planned without any discretionary authority, I want to see if this works again. Was supposed to be equal. Yeah, we already talked about that. Then why'd they need the beta connectors? To secure Collective against unforeseen threats from individuals who might wish to control it. That's impossible. Oh. It won't let me do it this time at all until the Alpha Connector. The enemies are dead. So an opposition force among equals could try to obtain the Alpha. This could lead to human casualties, which would be unacceptable. So how could beta connectors stop this from happening? They didn't give their carriers any discretionary authority, but they did allow them to be present within Collective without being a part of it. In other words, they had total autonomy while retaining access to the information. Oh God, this so is what? so, so Basically annoying. we have right now. You are seeing this from a human perspective. What other kind of perspective could I... Oh, crap. Boss wanted to put beta rings on some robots so no one else in the collective could control them. They are. At first, Dr. Sechenov planned to order his loyal twins to guard the Alpha Connector. While logged into collective, your team he could God. control them from anywhere on Earth. At the same time, no one else would be able to leave the borders. They wouldn't even know that they exist. Hold on, Charles. Huh? Yeah, okay. Yikes. First arm's good. Thank you, comrade.
scanning cycle. Module, limb, arm, left, found. Location, panel uh, floor. Uh, could you be a little more specific? Please select the desired procedure. That song is so good. <laughs> 